I'm uh, speaking tonight on behalf of Anthony. Uh, he couldn't make it with us tonight. Wait, I think he might be here. Wait. Oh, wait. Oh my God. Oh, wow. <laughs> what, a, what a special guest. Wow, look at him. <laughs> Now, if you're familiar with Southern California, then you may well know that the cities of Palos Verdes and San Pedro basically sit next to each other. And that's where Ginny and Julian grew up, respectively. Now, you would think that living in proximity to one another through elementary school and junior high and high school and afterwards that they would have met at some point. I mean, their two high schools played each other in sports, so they could have possibly seen each other at a football or basketball game. But alas, that did not happen until earlier in 2012 when their mutual friend, Lexi, thought that she would play matchmaker, whereby she conspired to throw a party, all of which led to nothing. I mean, the party was a good idea, and the introduction went well, and there was some attraction between them, but life was busy. They say timing is everything. In this case, the timing was just not right. But they did stay in contact. They did see each other when they both were in town. But it was not until the fall of 2015 that they had an actual first date, which was dinner at his house, a full-on Julian-prepared Croatian meal, followed by a movie and cuddling on the couch. And that is their story, the first few chapters at least. And we are all here to watch as they begin to write the rest of it. Nervous. I'm, yeah, it's hitting me now. I'm really nervous. I didn't think I would get that emotional, but yeah, it's finally happening. And he is literally the best thing that has ever happened to me, so I'm excited. <laughs> Julian, ever since I met you, you've made me a better person. You are my light, and you've showed me more love than I've ever known. You're my best friend, my soulmate, and my biggest supporter. I promise to show you for the rest of your life how much I love you, even if we disagree. You were there for me during one of the hardest times of my life. And I couldn't be more grateful to have you by my side. I love that we started out as friends. That is my favorite part. I love your caring nature. I love that I can be myself around you. I love that we push each other to be better and encourage each other to follow our dreams. You are truly my best friend and I wouldn't want it any other way. You are my everything, and I promise to love you forever. Round 
entire childhood, Julian and I were inseparable. When I left the house without him, he'd sit by the window and constantly ask my parents where I was and when I was coming home. While he might not wait by the window anymore, he still calls me 10 times a day to ask what I'm doing. Hey man, what you doing? I'm sure he still stares out the window, but now it's waiting for Jenny and Mia to come home so you can unleash his signature juju laugh. Jenny, I'm getting you a lifetime supply of earplugs because that laugh can be heard all across the South Bay. Yeah, I'm dreaming. Jeannie couldn't have picked a better man to share the rest of her life with. You know, um, this is where I'm supposed to welcome you to the family, but I gotta tell you, you were welcome to the family the first day I met you. Yeah, I'm dreaming. You are one of the most genuine, loyal, kind, sassy, and beautiful people I know. You are beautiful inside and out. I am proud to be your friend, and I could not be more proud of the nurse and wife you have become. I know we're missing someone very special tonight. I've had the pleasure of meeting your dad, Woody, and I know he's here with us in spirit and would have been proud to walk you down the aisle with Paul today. Woody would definitely be so proud of the woman you've become, the wife that you are. I know that he and Julian would have been such a great duo. In honor of Woody Woolwine, we love you guys so much. Jubilee! Yeah, I'm dreaming. my brother is reading you this message, I was not able to make the wedding. Of all the things I've missed while being out at sea, this one has hit me the hardest. For although your wedding night will be an important memory, it will be one of the thousands we have made together. The years that you've been together, your love for each other has only grown. I'm so happy that the day has finally come that we can celebrate your wedding. Jivili. some that can't be with us physically they are here in spirit and i know they are just as excited for you too as i am <laughs> 